All right, yeah, some be, rock and roll. Yeah, Grammy-nominated hard rock legends, Great White, in the music business for 40 years, heading to the IP Resort and Casino in Biloxi later this month. And joining us now, guitarist and keyboard player and producer Michael Lardy to discuss the upcoming performance, uh, along with the band Slaughter. Hey, it's great to have you on the show. Thanks so much um, for joining us today, Michael. It's it's great to be here and i just want to you know interject that uh, we love biloxi so much um we've been coming down there doing shows for at least uh getting pretty close to 15 years i mean non-stop like every year or every other year and uh last year was the first year we did ip and we love the building so we're really excited about being there yeah that's awesome and they have a great setup there for sure and i know that you have a really strong fan base around the country, even the world, but here in Mississippi, it's it's really hot, right? As far as those fans that you love. You know, they keep coming back. I mean, we've done sellouts at the Hard Rock. We've done sellouts at IP. Uh, you know, it's just Mississippi gets great white. It's just one of those things. Maybe it's our connection with the blues, uh, how people, you know, connect with that. Uh, but we're, we're lucky. I mean, we're, we're the age well, a band of a certain age. We were just talking about that <laughs> off, off mic. Um, that uh, still are able to go out and do 40 or 50 shows a year. I mean, I, I consider it such a blessing to be able to do that. I know. I mean, it's great. I mean, um, you and I grew up together. We didn't know each other, but we were growing up the same time. And, and I mean, for you to be doing what you love 40 years later, or not quite that long for you, I think the band has been together that long, but um, as, or the band has been around that long. But as far as uh, you being with this band, uh, mid-80s is when you started, right? Yeah, I actually met them in 83 when they came in to record their first record. I was a staff engineer at a studio and within about two and a half, three years, I started writing with them. And before I knew it, I was in the band. So it uh, was, you know, a perfect synergy of 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 circumstance and and being in the right place at the right time. And and we've been uh pretty much nonstop since that time, since the mid 80s. Yeah, I know the platinum selling uh, record Once Bitten Twice Shy came around during your era. Um, I think that was 1987, and then there were some top 40 singles along the way. What is it that you still love about the music and, and playing and, and just the being on the road? I know that has its ups and downs, but uh, what are the things you still love? I think one of the coolest things is to go and play, like, say, a festival in the summertime where you'll see Grandpa maybe putting his kid or his grandkid on top of his shoulders and the kid is rocking out and he's singing the lyrics to House of Broken Love or to Rock Me. And the, the child's maybe eight to 10 years old. You just think that how amazing it was that the the parent or the grandparent brought the music down through the generation and, and brought them into what we do and the fact that they connect with it and it becomes multi-generational. I think that's one of the biggest compliments as an artist you can pro you possibly get. Oh, definitely. I think that's fantastic. Well, uh, it's coming up Saturday, January 27th. You still have time to get tickets. Probably going to be a sellout again. Begins at 8 p.m. IP Casino Resort and Spa in Biloxi. Great White performing on the coast again and uh, michael lardy it was a pleasure to talk to you today and um, welcome back to the coast and uh, you as well and, and we promise it'll be warmer <laughs> it'll be it should be warmer then we don't have many cold spells like we're having right now thanks That's so much true. for being here with us thank you